are. I think it's just another speaker, though. Clatch it and rank. Let's go. Clatch it and rank. Ah. So, last time, uh, what happened last time? Uh, PS2. That happened. <laughs> oh, that's right. They want. We we're supposed to do it in. Uh, we we're supposed to do it in German today. Yeah. Well, I guess we can go back and watch the the videos whenever. Uh, so they switch it to German and watch a few videos in it just to see what it's like. Da. Da. No, that's Russian. Yeah. I think. I, is that a uh, go the options? <laughs> What did we did last time? We did Italian. Italian. The others are Spanish, German, and French. Wildin! Wildin! In the Sprach! Spielladen! Oh, that's right. We're in uh, Blackwater City with the hoverboards yeah. and the sewers. It's like we've hijacked a space to delivery ship or something. Okay. It's had some trouble loading Rilgar. Alright. Let's see some cutscenes. See if you watch them, whatever. I was wondering if the, the effects were any different. But, oh, oh. Subtitles. Camera. Oh, it's the. Was it? It's the. Yeah. Infobot. Oh, it's in it from the planet select is where we can uh, see them. Yeah. Here spricht Dana Gretsch live aus Blackwater City. So eben. Blackwater City. Intergalaktischen Hoverboardmeisterschaften, die in den nächsten Tagen hier stattfinden, Captain Quark dem Sieger den Hauptpreis überreichen wird. Darüber hinaus ist zu berichten, dass man hier in letzter Zeit an einem Befall durch Merkwürdige... None of these Infobots have Ratchet in them is the, is the thing. Die hüttige yeah. Stadtverwaltung hat versichert, dass alles nur Erdenkliche getan wird, um die Plage zu beseitigen. Das war Dala Cratch für Kanal 2 News. <laughs> She's just... Dana das... That's the same voice as uh, the other... Uh, as the English one, though. Well, it's so. very similar sounding, anyway. Hey, Clank, let's get back in the ship. But why? I want to see the other cutscenes in German. Excuse me? <laughs> uh, uh, I think Iridia had one of the... Can you not... Quark ones? Yeah. Was it a Quark one? It's gonna take us way longer to get through this game because of this. Yes. You know what? This game's pretty short. It's fine. Uh, what else? I think this was the, the first Drek one. Alright, Terry Drek. Hello, Bürger von. Hello! Mein Volk, die Blag, haben ein kleines Problem. I expected him to be deeper. Yeah. All the non-Kevin Michael Richardson ones aren't really that deep voice. Yeah. Drake. Yeah. Instead of Chairman Drake, it's Chairman Drake, the rapper. <laughs> hey, yo, yo, I'm going to steal all the, all the pieces of your planet and I'm going to blow the rest up. Yeah, cool, cool. Y'all got a problem with it? Fuck you. <laughs> Used to call me on my cell phone. What's the, what's the reset? Uh, or did you want to look at any others? Uh, I'll, I'll, uh, trigger all, like, bumpers and then the two, uh, and then start and select. Uh, yeah. What? The... Oh. Some games have it, some games don't. Oh, you might okay. Have... I thought we did it before in this one. I guess not. Yeah, it must have been in another one. 
Must Christ. have been in uh, Jaw. I, I think it was uh, Kingdom Hearts. Christ. So yeah, Jer the German ones are, sound Christ. dead on to the English ones. Super Cody going out radicals. Now I'm just picturing German Sonic. Kyoto Schwaden! Oh man, you think you think Sonic has a new meaning in uh, uh in the I don't even remember who last played you go ahead and start. Okay, thank you. Right. If I remember this level, uh Name name a like a, a well known German wrestler who was did not have a Nazi motif. Uh German Preferably uh, a face. Walter? Walter? No, he's a... Uh, I don't think he's German. Uh... Oh, God. Do they just... They don't just make all the German ones Nazis, do they? Uh, in WWE? No, they, nobody does really does Nazis, because... Because that, that'd be a bad idea! Even his heels? This, this was a long time ago, yeah. Like, uh... It... it Shout out to Hogan's Heroes. Sorry, I gotta get used to uh, playing with the. Uh, oh, check the shop. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Man, it's a good thing Ratchet can just swim. In shallow water. Yeah. Oh, we got a new thing. Is that the Devastator? Mind, Mind glove. glove. Eh. We have Hand of Doom. If, if we could upgrade the weapons by using them, it would be better to. Uh, use them. So this goes to the, the racetrack. The other way goes to the sewers. Okay. Uh, I'll go to the sewers. I'll take care of the sewer level so you don't have to. Ting. Ting. 57. Yeah, it's more important to get the weapons as soon as you're able to in the second game and on because the more you use them, the closer you get to upgrading them. But they're just totally optional in this one. The... Oh, wait, hold on. I need to... Yeah, the, big shot. Yeah, I, I like I like uh, later games where you're just able to just uh, use on quick select on triangle. To, yeah, sorry. I, I last time I played this game, I, last time I played at all on stream, it was uh, just press circle. It was uh, the uh, super. It was Super Mario Galaxy, and yeah. you know how the controls were for that. So we got we got the dolphin bar for that. We've not uh, met, we've not had time to get it set up yet. Yeah. The... So hopefully next time we'll be able to use the Wii controls. See how that goes. See, yeah. See how that goes. For At the very least, it'll be easier to trade off between us uh, on a whim. Because because we'll both be playing with the same. We've got our hydro displacer. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> That only works here, huh? Yeah. Again, later games, if there's only a specific spot it works in, it just pulls it out of that spot instead of having to use the wheel. Yeah. Makes sense. I think the hook shot works like that, too, as well. You just do the swing shot. That kind of stuff uh, requires context buttons. Like, context buttons uh, are very useful in... Uh, in games, rather than just like being, oh, this is an item you have to do. It's just like, how about you just assign like it to a to like an item that like uh... an everything item. Yeah. Because you're never using more than one at a time. Like, who... no, you got to displace the water level so you can use the hacking to to get through it. It won't short immediately. Oh, it goes down here. Oh, bolts. Oh, it's my oh. Minimal amounts of bolts. Three. Look, it's a whole, it's a whole one bolt. <laughs> Charles is gonna be mad he missed the German. <laughs> it's fine, you can check it out on YouTube. So then... And now we can swim in the sewage to the pipe. It's fine. This is all this video game sewage is blue. This is where the this is where they keep the purified water. Yeah. This is future. This sewers. is future sewage. This is how clean shits will be. <laughs> this egg banana. I wonder. We should probably swim through there before getting rid of the water. See what's on the other side. It's, uh, it's like. Oh, we have to. We have yeah. to drain it just to hit that. 
and then I think refill it again. I, I remember some hole being like that. This is all just piss. This is just planet piss. The sky is piss, the ground is piss! <laughs> the sky is piss. I, I'm imagining that. That actually does sound pretty much like hell. Yeah. Just breathing you know, piss. Really just imagine yourself in a urinal, you get the gist of it. I guess I have Yeah, now we gotta go back and fill it. Why, though? Do I really need to? Because you can't get up otherwise. I thought I was going down. No, there was no down. Oh. I could have sworn there was a down. Oh, well. Uh... still doesn't work. We're gonna have to use my weird controls. Well, there was some mention on the, uh, on the, like, Amazon page of a new version of it. <laughs> that, like, uh, older versions of the bar don't work with, uh, like, newer versions of Dolphin or something. Uh, that could be but, a problem, then, if Yeah, you... we'll have to, we'll have to find out, because this was, like, the version they were selling. I like that. I do love this uh, version of the box better than the crash one. Well, don't jump down yet. We didn't oh! explore the room yet. Fuck. I I didn't see that there. I tripped. I legitimately didn't see that. Yeah. Start running. Now there's a gold bolt somewhere in here, but keep going. Oh, it's oh. not stopped. I think we don't need to worry about it yet. I don't think we really can worry about it until we have the, like, breathing apparatus. I fucked up, Zelrock. Why is the water... We're being flooded! I'm from... Oh god, this is like that scene from fucking, uh... Per uh... Not Perfect Storm. Uh, The Abyss? Yeah? There's a scene... Oh man... It was just like, you got. They're like telling him to open it from the, the emergency release from the other side, and they're just like hitting the window because that section of the base is flooded. Oh crap! No! Yeah. Oh, well, we're up here again. Oh, okay, that, sure. Okay, room's empty. Confirmed. <laughs> got it. <laughs> now we know. I think it's along the right side here. Like down here? Yeah. There it is. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm not gonna be able to, uh... I, I won't survive this! Maybe not. Definitely not. It's so, uh, we'll be coming far. back here. Oh. oh, shit. Is it my turn because you died? Yeah, I died twice. Go for it. <laughs> you, you can die the twice. Sec the second time it might be Hest. It's fine. Uh, it's fine. We I was curious, too. I wouldn't have survived even if I got the bolt. Well, I don't... Maybe there was something to, like, reset the water in there or something, but... No, I guess you just can't get that until you have the the breathing device. So... So is this a, is this really a sewer or is it like a cistern? A cistern? Like a reservoir? Yeah. It's a very complex reservoir. The system of uh... Yeah, this is a... Uh, this is a pretty bad system. Why? Why are the? Why is the hallways flooding? What did we do? Uh oh. We must have done something. Yeah. Was I too slow? You were too slow. Well, 
rip. How the fuck did you survive that? I remember being pretty demanding. Ugh. Ugh. Clank! Oh, fuck me, Clank. This, that was rough. Thank Clank you. does not comprehend fear of asphyxiation. Why are you so worried? We don't have circuits. We need to breathe, buddy! Well, we made it here. Time to just get a bunch of bolts. Well, we're- what the fuck? Hey, hey, hey! Press conference is over! Captain Quark don't want no more reporters bugging him in Kevin his Michael trail. Richardson oh, again. You see, my friend and I need to speak to the captain about a matter of galactic security. You mean you and your walking camera? You paparazzi make me sick, now beat it! But sir, I'm sure the Captain Quark won't understand once we- Now, now, save it. I know how it works. You convince me to let you in, you snap a picture of the captain in his underpants, Under then pants. you sell a picture to the info tabloid for a million bucks. Info tab. Meanwhile, I'm stuck here making six bolts an hour, and I have to listen to- That's rough! That's the roughest- so you don't get in unless I get a kickback. In advance. Oh, that's it? You see how it works. You grease the hinges, the door opens. I, I guess we- it's a good thing we didn't get the mind glove. Captain Quark. What's that? It's Ratchet and Clank, Captain. You know, from the home. Oh, yes, yes, I That's his bed? <laughs> it's just yes, a sheet of metal. Right, the galaxy you found yeah. me. This is his trailer? There's an awful plot being hatched to destroy our planets. Ratchet, he knows. Great. Does that mean we can go hoverboarding now? My friends, we're all in grave danger. And I believe that together... <laughs> We can put a stop to this madness. Yeah. Did he do the 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 Reggie Jackson rainbow? Magic. He's keeping an eye on you. Magic. Never seen anyone with such raw talent. What? You are a true hero. In the making. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he's just bullshitting. I could be famous. Oh, absolutely. I mean, he's oh, not he's wrong. Famous. Yeah. Uh, info. What makes one man toil in obscurity while another becomes a hero? Is it strength, compassion, determination, or just pure blind luck? Wise men through the ages have struggled with that very question. But Captain Quark knows the secret. That's why he's been able to defeat more despots, rescue more damsels in distress, and save more civilizations than any other. <laughs> oh my God. That eye, that side eye, just your opportunity yeah. to see if you've got the stuff heroes are made People's of. People's eyebrows. This info lock contains coordinates to Quark's secret base. Can you quickly conquer Quark's killer cannonade of Quark's combat Mom! Can you quickly quark? Can, can you quickly quit? Oh! Just make your way through the defenses to the center of the base. Prove yourself. Learn the secret and earn your place in galactic history. Consult your doctor before attempting any strenuous exercise. Not responsible for death or dismemberment. Your results may vary. <laughs> so, get, get the fuck out of here. Go to my planet and then train. Wait, man. <clears throat> Meet me at my headquarters. Hey, Captain Ratchet. What do you think? We won't tell oh. you, sir. We promise. You'll become better than Captain later. General! No, Sarge! Sarge! You may be the Captain, but I am the Sergeant. Sergeant Slaughter's not done with you! You know what? If you want, you could play. You could just uh, play no, the. It's just like a shortcut. We can't actually. We haven't unlocked the other side yet. Nope. We have to open it from the other side. This will be a recompense for me uh, uh, playing Galaxy the entire time the other time. We don't need to do that. <laughs> I. <laughs> You want me to, to uh, play? I don't, I don't care. <laughs> Charles wanted you to play, so I guess okay. we'll wait if he shows up. He, he'll probably be watching uh, posts like after, uh, like on YouTube. Can I break these? Damn it! No. They're made out of ruby. That's a tank. The literal. Uh. Well, you to use the glove. Get him! The other ones go. They're just hopping around like They're assholes. Chilling. Oh, only two. Okay. 
That was comparatively easy. Yeah. <laughs> Come, my minions! The, the tanks will get uh, will get uh, more difficult afterwards. Soon. I think soonish. Why do you have to? Why does the game design to be like you gotta pay to uh, get through these certain checkpoints, but you also have to pay to uh, to like get weaponry? I guess to just like. Well, because the wep none of the weapons are really mandatory. So they want to, like, pay gate to be sure you're collecting bolts. Experiencing the maximum fun. You must experience this amount of fun in order to, pro to progress. Uh. Uh-oh. Fired for like a little bit, and then you're like, ah, fuck it. Well, because they were spread out. There's no shotgun weapon in this game, is there? Probably should use the bomb. On them. Do we still have that equipped? Okay. Yeah, we do. Yeah, is that that blast doesn't really have recoil, does it? No. <laughs> but it, it's like a single target weapon. It doesn't deal with groups very well. Yeah. Unless they're perfectly lined up. Well, I mean, for Ratchet either, he just kind of points it. He doesn't even realize he's shooting it. Yeah. He's just like, oh, it's going. That's the thing. Laser weapons, uh, theoretically, shouldn't have recoil. It makes them, like, the most accurate. Uh. Short range. Apparently. See, it's, it's because it's a civilian model. That works. They only take two hits, I just need to fucking hit them. Oh, he's still alive! It looks like, like, uh, Splicers from Bioshock, almost. Yeah. Hello, Robin. Hello. They really have, like, a, a, a trash problem. The Amoeba Boys. It, it's the Amoeba Boys! It's Alolan Mux. What was that? Oh. <laughs> oh, there are a lot of you fuckers. This works. This, this is almost too easy with just the wrench throwing. Did they nerf it in later games? I don't think so. I think they just, like, they made the weapons more necessary. They just made the games harder. Yeah, fair yeah, this, again, this is the easiest of the uh, games we're familiar with. I haven't played past the fourth one. That's when they kind of rebranded it. They made it like Ratchet & Clank Future, whatever that is. Uh, it's the future of Ratchet & Clank. I haven't heard bad things about the games, I just haven't gotten around to playing them. Uh, oh, you think that you think this is advanced? Wait till you see the future. It's all like crystal togas and like spires and crystal togas. <laughs> Sorry, toga that sounds uncomfortable. Togas and crystal spires is the trope name. Crystal togas. <laughs> oh, let's go downtown. These are very specific taxis. They only—they're more like buses. Yeah. They go to very specific destinations. Yep, and you don't have to pay a single thing because it's subsidized, I guess. Oh. I'll just, I'll let them deal with it. Yeah, you deal with it. Are you done? Okay. Why didn't that, like, hurt you? It was far enough away. Obviously. What a short range tank. What a short range, uh. And gun as well. Did not even notice me. <laughs> they, didn't, they didn't have time to react. We just heard, what's that sound? And then the fuel tank exploded. Got uh, a little more of an aggro range in the later games. Yeah, a lot of enemies do. The, uh, the range just gets totally improved. Oh. Oh, you want more of that? More of what? The glow of doom. 
You really... It's a mind people. blow. I know. No! Oh, I can't rob the phone booths. <laughs> I thought for a second they were like suicide booths or something. Like in Futurama. Yeah. Come on, kill me already! That was about we go for a two for. Hello! I know for you, robot. Treat you. Well. Okay, Ratchet. I'm kidding. Sorry, he's not for sale. But what's a rhino anyway? Rip ya a new one. What did you just say to me? R Y N O. Rip ya a new big one. fucking well, gun. <laughs> galaxy. I know it's worth a lot of bolts. He must have stolen it from the floor. Stolen? Look, trash can. Did I say anything about it being hot? You better watch your mouth, or I'll. Wait, don't tell me. Rip ya a new one. <laughs> you need a oh, we can get that. <laughs> what if we did just leave it overnight and we just had that next stream? That would actually uh, make it could. be pretty fun, just... <laughs> but we wouldn't want to make this incredibly challenging game too easy. Yeah, fuck it, let's just... Yeah, rip you a new one. Just use that and just... There are bosses in this game, right? Yeah. Yeah, just use that on everything. Not a oh. ton of them, but they exist. This game does not have the arenas that uh, later games do. Yeah, the... But, like, the arenas in the later games get really fun. Why is- why are your sewers, like, exploding in steam? Yeah, this is a public health hazard. They're flooding it with salt to get rid of the slugs. I guess that may actually makes sense. That would happen in a, in a movie called- a horror movie called Slugs. Yeah? And, uh, and- but, it, no, instead of using just salt, just pouring it down there, they just decide to set their sewer on fire. As is the only logical it. choice. Because <laughs> that's where all the slugs were congregating. Also, there's a scene in which a dude uh, didn't realize that slugs were in his salad. He ate the salad. He's like, man, that, that meal was salty. Then he was later at, like, uh, like a few days later, just, like, at a, with his wife at a restaurant, and suddenly slugs just explode from his body. Yeah. Are they, like, alien slugs or something? No, I guess they're just, like, regular slugs. They're just, like, the okay. slugs that happen to be... You know, evil. Okay. But rather than being giant, it's just a bunch of them. You wake up, you're finding power in slugs, and they're just eating you. Or something. Just... I, I remember, because because uh, they were like leading up to just uh, the scene in which they were going to blow up the sewers and sit us off watching the movies, like... Get some salt. Yeah. Get, just buy, go to the grocery store. Buy some salt. Ugh. Skeet shooting. That was loud. Yes. Hey, yeah, you Slugs. did. Slugs. Kill the slug. Get some slug. So, uh, what's the purpose of this room? This is just an arena? Why are you guys locked up? Did the slugs do this to- Did the slugs outsmart you? <laughs> oh, man. They look they so get... confused and why defeated. Are they... Why are they so smart? This... No, it's just that you guys are just really dumb. Damn it. It's a powerful, like, uh, force field imprisonment. Well, we gotta release him. I guess. Oh. We're surrounded! I know what to do. Oh, crap, they still hit me. Uh -oh. I don't know what to do. Minions! Shoot them. That sounds like the best option, just to shoot them from, you know, a distance. I can't wait for there to be, like, targeting, because this game really needs, needs like, it needs a lock-on. Yeah. Like, the first uh, edition. And, you know, not, like, an unlockable lock-on, just, like... I think it's an unlockable in all the games. You unlock Z-targeting. 
I mean, to be fair, like, in real life, you have to aim. Lock a lock on is kind of an additional feature. It's a well. I mean, I'm trying to think. Uh, I know Metroid Prime had a lock on feature out, out straight out the gate. I mean, most shooters do. Uh, Call of Duty did didn't it had ADS not lock on? Yeah. Uh, although I guess you could use your ADS to kind of snap to uh, to an enemy. Oh, I just remember Keith David, the voice of Atlas. He was in, uh, he's in, uh, Call of Duty. Right? Yeah? As just, like, a soldier. He's like, like, if you don't aim down your sights, you're gonna spray bullets all over the damn place. Alright, uh, alright, uh, player character, shoot at the t these targets that you just shoot at, at them. Just from the hip, and they're like, you see, he's spraying spray bullets all over the damn place. Yeah. That's the tutorial section, the one where it's like... Yeah, we need you to be trained by these British dudes. So you can work for the CIA. You gonna get trained by Britain to work for America? Ta no, it's the CIA Task Force, Task Force 141. Oh. They're like, uh, it's like made up of like, uh, this former SAS and... God. The series gets the series got like anyway. That's weird. Just because in the first game you those characters uh, showed up when they were working as SAS, and then and uh, in the in, uh, Modern Warfare Two, they were just working for the CIA. Yeah. And, and it's just because I don't know why they they felt like they 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 could, but you know. It's fine. What are the routes we got? Just, why don't you try throwing your wrench through the bar? Like, throw the wrench through the Okay. But I tried through the lasers. It didn't work. Oh, oh it just bounced off? Yeah. Okay. Those guys don't drop bolts. No, because they're lazy slugs. Because they're slugs, they have no, they see no value in material wealth. Did that disable that one? Uh, or was that one not not active? I don't think it was active. Well, hmm. uh, do you have to restart from the very beginning, or? Uh, no. I th I think I remember what you need to do here. What's that sound? <laughs> that that sounds like like gunfire getting off of in an explosion. Yeah, you Worthless got us tanks. Oh man, there were. <laughs> Okay, so I think there was a scene I, from like a movie. I don't remember which one, but it was. I know this movie existed, and it was uh, a scene in which a guy was like, it got spooked and he started shooting at like a truck as it was like rolling down with nobody in it, and it just took like like a hundred rounds, right? And it was moving quicker and quicker towards this other truck, and it started slowing down because it leveled off. And then just kind of tap the bumper of like the other truck, and then both trucks explode. Yeah. Which made me think it was a comedy. Just sounds like a comedy scene. But... <laughs> oh, invisible walls. Uh uh uh. I thought of that too. Mine. <laughs> you, just, you just mastered that. The ammo is really so abundant in this game. Yeah, it's it's more of a problem in later games. Or because you're using everything way like way more. Yeah. Just a, it's just a matter matter of gradual balancing. 
Yep. I feel like once uh, Ratchet gets some power armor, that's when the series uh, like turns around. That shit's expensive, though. You remember how much the price went up just from one stage to the next? Oh, yeah. The, well, it better be. It's like... I, I, I don't want to spring for some cheap power armor. Like... One one quarter armor was a thousand bolts, then one half armor was like a million bolts. It just skyrocketed. <laughs> well, yeah, it was ha it was half. It was double the price of. It was way more than double. It was like way, way, ten, way more than double. Like ten times, wasn't it? Something like that. Uh, you you just. Well, 8,000. Oh good, I can destroy those with bombs. Yeah. Make sure this is open. Alright. Oh, is this the- is this the, the- the area? This is the area. Oh, sweet. You remember how to- how to I, I do. It? I'm just- I'm- I'm clearing out the, the bolts first. I gotta rob them blind before anything else! Back to the ship. I'm the last of my kind, Ratchet. Welcome to the like... Hovercon Intergalactic Hoverboard Competition. Terra Strong? Quirk's giving away a brand new Platinum Zoomerator to the winner of this competition. Oh, oh, that perhaps. Platinum Zoomerator. Perhaps that will be the proof of your accomplishment. Actually, that sounds like a Laura. Agent requires. From Spyro. Do you guys mean Skid McMarks? Yeah, Skid couldn't make it. So we're here to, you know, fill in for him. <laughs> Guess we'll see about that. Yeah. All right. He doesn't want to keep doing it. He only wants to do it once. You notice it? Is it? Is it happening? It seems like it's happening. Tis subtle. Tis. Tis very subtle. God. Tis less subtle. <laughs> she, she, oh man. Zoom in is a. Uh, this is the uh, the back problems cheat. Is it a cheat or is it a glitch? We still never really. Figured. I don't think it's a. It seems pretty intentional. God, you just be able to do that forever. It's just. God. <laughs> This game, this game is like is like a juvenile sense of humor that is just threatening to just come out at every second. Have we but plateaued? Yeah. I think we've plateaued. Yep. Those are those are some glorious. Uh, gee. Uh, Throw us some polygons. Uh, L. L it's Lady Tsunade. Oh, I'm here now. Oh, okay. How do? How do how I race? Not like that. Uh, I think you have to hold the button to go faster. Oh, you have to do tricks to go faster. Remember? <laughs> so there. So in order to get crates. It requires abusing, uh, being here. Yeah. Yes. Okay, you're still in fifth. I know. I, I think all of the shoulder buttons do tricks. Makes sense. X jumps. I'm trying to figure out how to... Do I, like, accumulate boost or something? I... Or do I just... It just seems to happen do I just when it happens. get boosts by landing? Maybe that... I don't think we have boost yet. I think we have to unlock that by winning this. Oh. Beginner's luck, buddy. That's probably what they're gonna say. Like, ah, oh, you got it. Oh, it's beginner's luck. Here, try with this boost now. 
No, I think you just unlock the boost by winning this event. Oh. Is there another event then? Or is boost just there to be useless? I think so. I know there's like a skill point for getting a time on this course, I think. Ah. Well there we go then. Oh god, I forgot. This was this is a this is a very demanding uh, race. New best time, but no new score. Try again! So you're gonna wanna actually hug the inside on that first turn because there's a boost pad there. Not there, but... Where, were you... Was that... What? Nothing. Oh, is this the opposite? Like, is there an opposite, like, uh... Form of this race? No. Oh, it's just... I guess there's no point to flippy tricks without boost. Yeah. Just gotta play for speed. Yeah, there's uh, the turn off the inside. Oh, you missed. Solve them! This is what Skid McMarks does. I guess I guess he totally could find just being attacked by aliens, uh, you know, not that big a deal. This is the stuff he does. Just high speed, dangerous, uh, like, racing. Yeah. Second place. You wanna try? Uh. you can quit and re-enter. That is very quick loading, at least. Yeah, I, I appreciate that. Right. Yes! Okay, I can always just jump over the... I think it's pretty forgiving. <laughs> Shit. So there is a way to, like, get on here without having to be a hoverboard racer. Yes, and I'll have to remember what exactly that is. Or I'll have to look it up later. Why did I slip off there? That was a bit of an optimistic jump. I think that 
hit the... I notice every time we back out that uh, our actions are still in effect. Our assets are still there, still loaded. Okay, you, you want... you try it. You know what? It's... That so, really is as fast as just like going down to a retry button. Yeah, it is. It's two button inputs, probably faster than some like one button inputs in other games. Yeah. Wow, this guy is good. Are we actually racing skipping marks? Is this just a race of extreme sport aliens? I guess so. This is the uh, the SK9. What the what guy in first is a robot. SK9. SK8. SK9 is the the future version. Yeah. I'm just imagining uh, SK8 is like is like a non-lethal skateboarding version, of like HK47 from Knights of the Old Republic. Yeah. Just the, the HK47. Uh, he was he had no like uh, he had no ability to show emotion in his voice. So he'd always preface what kind of uh, statement uh, that he was making with like, like, uh, like statements. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You are a cunt. <laughs> It'd be like, Period. Observation. <laughs> I think there was one where it was like, veiled threat. My master, I do not appreciate you taking your weapons from taking my weapons from me. Did you just say veiled threat? Clarification. No, you. I did not. You must be mishearing th things. Yeah. Does I imagine that? Hey, folks, SK8. Captain Quark here. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce this year's HoverCon Intergalactic Champions. Let's give it up for newcomers. Ratchet and Clank. Hey, Walk. That's us. Today's winners will take home a brand new professional grade Marvel P15 from Zoomerator. Manufactured by Gadgetron, back in the 2000s, gamers get away with this kind of speed shit. Speed and maneuverability than any other anti grab device on the market. Are you sure you won't need this, lady? You seem like you'll need this. Your info box to the Quark Classic Channel for tonight's episode of Dogfight Over Death Canyon. What? Thank you. I have a channel based off of me. <laughs> so he's the Oprah of this world. Yeah. If Oprah Winfrey was also like a superhero. Yeah. <laughs> Oprah, so, but in Marvel. So, uh, there was a. There was a funny, uh. There was a Azumanga Dio fanfic I read, which uh, apparently Oprah Winfrey was the president of the United States. Yeah. And. It, 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 she was apparently like a apparently found the time to not only be president but also do her show. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like, man, I like I like fiction like that where it's just something quirky like that. I assume The Apprentice isn't still going on. Uh, if it is, it's probably under a different person's like banner. Are we done here already? I think so. There's nothing else, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So this is a dead end. If you you're like, oh crap. Well, I guess we gotta go check up on other leads. Off to Quark. Well, we got the Quark's HQ one here. Yeah. Well, we found him. There was no. What? Well, but but Thrachic, we don't. We know he's not going to be at the. At the. We have to be. We have to get his training to become heroes so that we can fight direct together. I would love to take on the HQ if you would let me. Sure. Go for it. Uh, you your, I, your quirk to girl arc. Yeah. <laughs> well, wait, he's our ally. What? This is a girl arc. The girl bar arc. Sure. We're going on a training arc. Imagine if Genkai had uh, like a super fortified house full of demons and spirit defenses, and she was just like, "Come at me, bitches! You want to learn the spirit ways?" <laughs> Genmo is one of the best old lady characters in the uh, in anime. Genkai. Genkai, sorry. Genma. What? I can't hear you. I said, haven't we done? Sorry. Still 
the animation's a ratchet. Uh, he always seems happy. Yeah. All right, Clank, let's get going. All right, HQ. All right, what? Anything new besides the mind glove? Uh, nope. What, uh, what'd you say? Did you say mind glove? I, uh, you want the mind glove? No, no, you you want the mind glove? No, no, you want Seamus? So. A wrestling story. Uh, one time, a company was uh, trying to contact uh, WWE to like uh, find out who would be like uh, like their spokesperson for their product. I forget. I think it was like uh, like some cereal ad or something. They were like, "Well, we wanted to get CM Punk and it, or like Daniel Bryan," and they're like, "No, you should get Sheamus." And then they're and uh, the company's like, "No, we want the one of these two." And then, I think it was Vince McMahon was like, no, you want Sheamus. Yeah. I... The comp... The company didn't get Sheamus. Yeah. Did they get the who they wanted? Uh, I don't remember. I don't think so, considering it's WWE and they'd rather... They'd rather do a bad thing their way than do a good thing somebody else's way. Oh, we're thinking this. Uh, Jay Z became the first mi uh, billionaire rapper. Oh, is he a billionaire now? Yeah. Why did I do that? I don't know. I guess there are dinosaurs here. <laughs> I have no idea why I did that. Okay, well, it's a good thing deaths don't matter in this game. So seriously, this time, let's let's do it. Billionaire. Well, he, he he didn't just do it by rapping. No, but he's the first person who's a billionaire and also a rapper. People talk about millionaire rappers now. We got billionaire rappers now. Gee, Jay Z was really good at like branding himself, man. Yeah. And just like selling his product, he sold Beats for to. He basically created like an overpriced headphone company, made it another company's problem, and got rich doing it. So Dr. Dre didn't start Beats? Yeah, be oh, yeah, you sorry, you're right. What the fuck am I... <laughs> oh, God. That, there goes my hip-hop cred. Uh... It's how much I care about, like, the business uh, behind the hip-hop world. I care more about... Well, that didn't work out. So... Oh no, an armed death base. I should be more careful. Can I... No, you those aren't mines? Shoot... No, those are bullets. No, I saw... Oh, I the thought... spiky... No, those are just plants. Okay. Now, is it temporarily disabled or permanently dis... Oh, okay. Only temporary for those. Can't destroy them. You can't kill those ones. Health. I wouldn't want this to be an easy game. I I must heal. Or you. Yeah. I did it. All right. So, this, this is his very, base. Uh, this is very clubby music. It's very, like, deep, bouncy synth. Yeah, it's like... It's a, it's a dark synth club. Where, like, two hackers are, like, uh, are meeting in order to exchange information. Yeah. Under the cover of, uh... What was the song that played in the club in The Matrix? Uh, which... which the first like, the Matrix. First club? Oh, uh, that, that's a, that was a remix of Dracula by oh, Rob right. Zombie. You know, the song about, like, uh, how Our Uncle car? Fester really, really likes his, his uh, car. Yeah. His, or, what, was it? F F no, it, was it a monster? Fester. Or, yeah. Oh, uh, it was... It was the monster. Shit! Car, right? 
Oh, damn it. Oh, fuck! Checkpoints? What are those? Alright, this is- this- this level. I've been underestimating this level for too long. I need to stop underestimating this level. It's like... If you think about, like, the lyrical content comparison to The Matrix... There's not a lot in common? Yeah, just... Yeah, I'm gonna take a ride in my Dragula, and it's just like, but... But we're all robots. I mean, does it have to be topical, though? It's just a song playing in a club. I do appreciate that, uh, the machines, uh, have, like, have taste in something. Yeah. Like, no, we so, gotta take this song! This song's dope as fuck! So in the fictional universe of The Matrix, I guess they just... Like, that's set in the future, so, uh... Yeah. So they, it's just an old recording of Rob Zombie. The, the, apparently, they, like, the reason why the movie is set in, in the 90s and also in the future is that, like, they said, Oh, the 90s are the, were the perfect time in human civilization! Yeah. It was, like, the most idealistic time! <laughs> and it was just like... Yeah, okay, sure. We'll go with that. Well, the 2000s weren't idealistic. Yeah. Which is funny, because The Matrix was made, was made in, like, the early 2000s. Yeah. It was, it was funny to make that during, like, the height of, like, government paranoia. Well, not the height, but the dawn of government paranoia. When was the, the George Bush, we're gonna record your phone calls? That was 2004? That was... Yeah. It was, uh, it was... After, uh... After the terrorist attacks. Uh, the Bush administration wasn't until 2008. That's when Obama got in, right? Yeah. Obama... Obama came in on a platform of... This recession's kicking all our asses. We should probably do something about it. I got extremely lucky there. There are crates back there. Give me a oh, I didn't take any damage. Wow. Those ones just don't give a fuck. I guess those ones don't home. They okay. Just go in a circle. <laughs> I'm not complaining. Yes. Give me all the cash. Wait, do we lose all our bolts on every death? All the cash, and all the cash. Do no. we lose bolts on death? No, we don't. I could have sworn that was higher. No. That was the only. The only thing to note is that, uh, like, if you spend money, ammo doesn't come back. So if you spend money on ammo and then use it and then die, that's money's gone. Which is why I don't like to buy ammo in these games. Uh, if at all possible to avoid. Just shoot them. I'm running out of blaster ammo. Oh, I have to be on the ground to use it. Shit. Oh, do you really? Yeah, I can't. Well, I guess that's a feature for later games. Air throwable bombs. Can't gain more height. Sorry. Sorry. Had that. Can you, uh, can you, like, L1 and aim them higher to get more distance? Uh. Does not seem to be the case. It, it, distance is locked. Sorry, bro. Alright, so this, uh. Oh, yeah. It's like the switches in Sonic Heroes, but you can do them with one person, and they don't suck. <laughs> and also, but but they're timed, so so be careful. This is where I'm. Yeah. Shit! You know, knowing Quirk, that's probably a feature rather than just faulty design. Yeah. Fuck it, maybe it's both. I mean, they were they were noticeably off color. <sighs> that was close. Nope, not over here. Ah, uh, the bullet whip. My beloved weapon. <laughs> I haven't seen that weapon since Gungeon. Or since the Gungeon. Alright. 
How many? So he he just this is where he sends to people who are like you know oh god they're on my trail I'll send them to the obstacle course they won't survive this. Yeah, you think so? This is his way of uh, subtly getting rid of people that are like you know. They no, almost know his true nature of being like some kind of coward or this is the this monkey, is the mountain monkey fucker or this is the mountain leading to the true master Jack. Oh yeah, it has to be a trial because you have to earn the training. That's fine. I, 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 you have to defeat the bear, the snake, and the monkey. Oh god, another badass woman character, the true master. Do you think they ever run out of bullets? Can uh, they just recollect them and just reuse them? This is a, it's energy weaponry. Oh. That's why it's so slow. Alright. Now, I think there's something around the backside. Yeah, I see around the backside of the building behind you. Oh, this one? Yeah. Alright. Uh. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. They give you ample time. Yeah. I mean, I, I hope, I wish that was like a Mario thing where it's like you can, you have to hit three switches in like a short time period. I'm sure you could manage something like that in Mario Maker 2 or something. That'd be nice. Yeah, they had the uh, Mario Maker 2 once again. A lot of features. Uh, what is it? It's supposed to be released this month, right? I think. June 21st? Is that it? No, that's uh, Crash Team Racing. Uh, I don't remember Mario Maker. I'll check it out. E3 is this month. So I'll get, we'll get more news there, I'm sure. Yeah, get trailers for games that may or may not deliver. <laughs> Spyro on Steam. Spyro on Steam. You saw they're, uh, they're doing like an Insane Trilogy style remake of Spongebob? What? Battle for Bikini Bottom? That that was a game that was so popular it warranted a remake. I get I'm surprised too, but people are people are happy about it. All those I guess Darian grew up on SpongeBob game, and a bunch of other people did too apparently. You know what? If if there's at least it's an example of a licensed game that's uh, good or like pop or you know well loved. Yeah. Cuz most often times people think about licensed games and they they just think of disappointment. Yeah. Like how uh, Angry Video Game Nerd was like really into uh, like Ghostbusters, and he's like, "Oh yeah, there's a Ghostbusters game," and it ended up being a major disappointment. Yeah. Just there. I I vaguely remember if it the like the newer Ghostbusters game or an old one. An older one. Okay. Because there was a newer one that I think. People said had pretty decent multiplayer. It team up raids to uh, to like capture ghosts. All right, I, so one's over there. I need to find the other two. Oh, there's more crates back there. Hold on. So this fucking assault course over here, just using live fire. Don't use like barbed wire or landmines or anything. Just spray bullets along the ground constantly. Oh, man. Do we ever watch, uh, Starship Troopers? Uh, no. We should. I'm reminded of, like... Oh, shit. I have no idea where the other two could be. Well, I guess I'm looking for them the hard way. We, we've walked by them several times. There's this one here. There's one in the back left. Back left. This... To the right. The... <sighs> I, I, I don't want you... I don't want to be... Like, there going to be any kind of miscommunication. This is... I, because if there's miscommunication here... Oh. Okay, good. It's fucking assault course. Yeah. Well, he's got barbed wire on the walls. That doesn't even hurt, I don't think. No, we're fine. It's it's barbed wire. If it was a laser fence, that'd be a different thing. 
That'd be a whole nother can of worms. Lombaxes are uh, naturally barbed wire resistant. <laughs> you know, being small and all. Is he ever called that specifically in this game? I don't think so. He's just alien or... I, <laughs> I think maybe in the manual he's called a Lombax. I don't understand why they feel the need to go, hey, yeah, you don't have a home planet anymore. Like in other games. Yeah. Like, they're... He has to be the last of his kind. It's dramatic, Jack. There's no reason for it! It doesn't factor into any of the games! It's just, you're just like, oh, he's, he's, he's the last of his kind. I think Why? It, I think it factors into a later game where it turns out, oh, he's not the last of his kind. I thought I was the last of my kind. Or it, it, it clanks like, you thought you were the last of your kind. You didn't, you didn't well, tell me this. Well, aren't you a special snowflake? Like... It's just so, it's just because it's, A, it doesn't, it doesn't factor in any, anything, and B, Ratchet is pretty chill about, about that. Yeah. Well, yeah, you I'm just have to accept I, it. I've come to accept. It which just leads to tell me that apparently at some point Ratchet had an angsty teen phase. Yeah. That's Ratchet and Clank past. <laughs> right, right, it's Ratchet past, because Clank wasn't even built yet. Yeah. I guess technically we're carrying an infant on our backs. <laughs> you fucking... It's made of rust. That's... No, my rust statue! <laughs> Alright, next part. Up the ladder. This is how I climb a ladder. I don't know about you. <laughs> oh, oh. You can double jump up that. Can't yeah. enough aerobics. Oh, you can't? No. Damn. But what if I have no hydro, hydro displace thing? Then you swim. <laughs> oh, gosh. The, the sound effect, man. Just... That fish has legs. Has evolved to go out on the ground and like hunt uh, predators that aren't that don't see it coming. They'll never see this coming. Oh god, a land shark! Look at that waddle. You don't want to deal with land sharks. Oh man. Wasn't there a scene in, in there's an episode of King of the Hill where like a bunch of the gang get like sent to a mental institution by by accident like Boomhauer was chilling in like a river and he got swept away and somebody found him and they thought he was some crazy dude because of the way he talked. Yeah. And then uh, Dale tried to come get him and his anti like and his government conspiracy theories also landed him in the psych house. Yeah. I don't know if Bill ever goes there, but I know Hank eventually bails them out by doing something. Yeah, I did not. I didn't watch. I caught King of the Hill now and again, but I didn't watch it religiously, so I didn't. Uh, I definitely have not seen every episode. <laughs> King of the Hill, a normal guy. Oh. <laughs> So, somebody, uh, so every time somebody new gets signed to All Elite Wrestling, they just have a picture of a person and they go like, uh, like, oh, this person is All Elite, and it's been it's been happening a lot for like recent signees, and then somebody just decided to make an edit and it just says a picture of Hank Hill. Hank Hill is All Elite. Yeah. Just. So it's it's so like a uh, it's like a. Uh... Breaks into Smash. Yeah. It's, it's just that, but it's for wrestling. It's the poor equivalent of, of uh, Breaks into Smash. Can I shoot in the water? Yo. Oh, the, the, the water. bullets vanish. <laughs> they're not bullets, they're lasers! Oh, the lasers vanish. At least I think they're lasers. I'm not sure anymore. I mean, you know, by definition, a laser is a beam. 
Plasma. Blasters. Blast! Is that, is that, those are sea cells or just shit? Or just, just hard shells? Hardened, like. In Digimon, they would be shit. Yeah. I feel bad for this one. There we go. Now I can kill it on a good conscience. <laughs> I want you at your best when I kill you. Oh man, I'm reminded of this one Alfred Hitchcock, uh. Episode Alfred Hitchcock presents. Yeah, and uh, it was this uh, this uh, assassin who's going after this woman, right? And then this, the woman was like, uh, was like, oh yeah, go ahead and do it. I really have nothing to live for. And the guy's like, think about it. And then he's like, he's like, yeah, what's going on? Well, this other person, this person's bothering me and is making my life a living hell. He's like, well, how about I take care of him for you? What you do that? Like he's like, yeah. And then he does, and then he does, right? In, in like a non-threatening, or like a threatening way, but not a murderous way. Yeah. And he's like, so, what else? And she's like, well, yeah, I've always wanted to own a business. Like, he's like, no problem, I'll help you get that set up. And basically helps her get back on her feet. And then she's like, I'm happy. I'm glad you were helping me. Oh, uh, so, you, so you're pleased with your life now, right? And she's like, yes, it's, and then she turns around and he sees he has his gun out and he shoots her. Yeah. I'm like, damn, that's that that's gold. Alfred Hitchcock is like uh, is like uh, tw Twilight Zone with noir for noir. Yeah, it, it, I liked it. Anything under here? Or no fish, thankfully. You have now crossed into a place of memory, of drinking, of tears in the rain. You, you are in the the Hitchcock, the Hitchcock zone, zone. <laughs> the noir zone. It's just, it's just Twilight Zone, except it's all noir stories. The Twilight Zone, except it's about the vampires. Oh, man. You should, you should watch a few episodes of Alfred Hitchcock Presents. Yeah? It is seriously, like, like, it was a really good show. Like, Twilight, Twilight Zone era show. And, and they each all have, like, a really good, like, like story in, in them, and I think not all of them were Hayes Code compliant. I think some of them ended in a certain way that made you think it was not Hayes Code compliant. Too, he got around the Hayes Code yeah. by basically using the uh, ambiguity. Well, not not just the ambiguity, but also he him just like telling him, "Oh, don't worry, they they got arrested. Trust me." Yeah. <laughs> just so he could like so he was able to exercise creative freedom that way. It was pretty, it was pretty cool. Oh man, can you imagine Hayes Code compliant video games? I, I could try, yeah. <laughs> and GTA wouldn't be around. No. GTA, uh, you'd have, but I think True Crime Streets of LA would still be a thing. GTA, except the, the cops are just like impossibly difficult. Oh, <laughs> you gotta do crime legally. Uh, yeah, I. I don't think, I, I think if the Hayes Code was enforced for video games, it would make a whole lot of, uh, uh, things difficult. Like, I don't think, I don't think Japan had to deal with the Hayes Code, did they? Uh, I don't think they had to deal with anything like that, no. Except for, like, importing, but that was, like, drive it, but that was a... I mean, the, America really a, was kind of the heart and home of the origin of, mo of movie making, of the moving picture. Yeah, well, as an art form, yeah. Other countries, uh... I think, I, I think the actual camera was, like, invented by an, uh, by an Englishman, but... Or something, but, uh... It's a shame that the first uh, picture with sound ended up using... <laughs> I, I, I... Anyway, uh, that's a whole other conversation. Hey! We did it! Oh, well, you do good. To surprise me. Yeah, I thought that would have the ring of heroes, and I will finally give the you the ring what of you heroes. What you just this is no time for you to become cautious. We have reached our goal. I don't know. <laughs> I don't trust you all. Lawbacks have a great intuition for people. Ratchet, your destiny is mere steps away. 
It's just something doesn't seem right. This doesn't seem right. This sinister voice he's using. Help us stop Jeb and Drek. Why, thank you, Clank. You've been most helpful. Ah, oh, shit. It didn't even have, like, a Star Trek opening. It just hinged open. <laughs> yeah, I just... What do you mean? What do you think he means, genius? He's not gonna help us. He's gonna kill us. You catch on quick. Although there is one problem with your hypothesis. I'm not, go I'm not going to kill you. You're he not? is. No. He is. <laughs> Fuck it. What? The snaggle Why? beast. Why? Why? It's really not that. No music. Who needs it? <laughs> I'm the official it's fine. For Drek's new planet. I can't have you two getting in the way of my comeback. This isn't over, Quark. No. But it will be soon. Yeah, one way or another. <laughs> Shoot it till it dies! <laughs> I'm running out of ammo! Oh, it's got shields. Shields up! It seems to have phases. Oh no, it has key! <laughs> it's key play! Oh no, you took- you stole from Universe 7, you fools! Which universe do you think this is? The robots one? Uh... Maybe? I-I-I have a hard time believing that consider- Well, maybe that's true, considering the weapons here are so advanced they can just blow up a tank in like, five hits. Oh man. Ratchet is somehow as strong as Goku. It'd be a little, little far-fetched. Okay, Krillin. Oh, I can't throw this front when I'm, uh, standing either, or jumping. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, no, no. Plan B! Too long, too long. So, too... <laughs> this yeah! thing is tough as shit! Yeah! Combat! Yeah! Eat! Eat plasma! Eat breath plasma sword breath! I love I love a, a good sci-fi series that is just like, you know what, we're gonna we're gonna make up our own slang. Yeah. You know what Star Wars didn't have a lot of slang? Yeah, it didn't have a lot of like uh well, everyone on, on, on the ship was uh, was well educated and a respectable member of space society. On <laughs> Solo. I love how they, that they were somehow able to still have the phrase over my dead body. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh. Ow. Here's a question. Would you, pre you prefer if Han shot first or if uh, Greedo shot first? Han? Yeah, <laughs> well, it's more, it's more interesting if he shoots first, because he's like, he knows that he's got a gun trained on him, he's like, okay, you know what, I was gonna shoot this guy. <laughs> oh, what? You're he sucked ammo. my ammo away. Gonna have to use the pi the pyrocitor. You can do that? Are you sure you weren't just like... No, he did a move where he sucked the ammo out of my body. Uh oh. Alright, that's fine. Never mind. Never mind! Oh, that. Hey! You know what? Oh, if only there were crates left, you could use the, uh, the suck cannon. Well, I can still, uh, I can, I can go get the ammo. If I could make these jumps. <sighs> Better jump back down, I guess. Oh, now all the ammo's yeah. just spawned. Well, yeah, all the ammo's respawned. You're fine. Despawned. Oh. Get Oh, those are gonna be gone. Kill, get him! I was gonna wait for him to stop stomping. There we go. Those much... don't deal a lot. Two. Yeah, you're maxed out. Oh, oh no, no, what? I guess oh. they didn't despawn. I guess this is my original ammo counts. Oh, man.
but Quark, why? Very uh, slow moving boss. Yeah, a bit. With the little wings, it looks like he could have been a Spyro boss. It really wants you to use the Glove of Doom on that guy. Does it? You're getting Glove of Doom ammo. Is that just giving you blaster ammo? It's the stuff that he sucked out of me. Oh, wow. He's got- well, he can only do the stomp in the center, I guess. Oh. <laughs> Why isn't he able to generate a four- he is literally just like some space wizard. Space Wizard Orc. He gained ultimate power, but he lost his mind. That's why he's got those little wigs. He's been touched by a by an uh, alien god entity. Yeah. Space Cthulhu. Space Cthulhu. I guess that's just regular Cthulhu. <laughs> the other Cthulhus are Land Cthulhu or Sea Cthulhu. Squids. <laughs> oh man, you think? The other people go insane at like seeing Cthulhu, but the Inklings are like, they 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 know what's up. Master. <laughs> Cthulhu's just confused. No, fuck off. Quit that. Boy. Good boy. We did. No, we did. Yes, we did. No, we did. He looks confused. Like he's uh, having second thoughts about walking onto this bridge. He remembers the first. Two. <laughs> he's like, well, what are the what are the chances this will happen? Like, like seriously. Oh! Bad way to die. No thumbs up. Darn. <laughs> Well, uh, I... I guess that's that. Now we just have to cross the lava. Ratchet, I... SAVE IT, CLANK BREATH! But that's my name. That insult doesn't work on any level. I wonder what that info bot is for. Maybe it can replace you. We're pinned down! We're pinned down! The ships are hammering our position from the air! Why is there film green? We need support now. Support. Actually, I need support. My entire battalion went AWOL and left me to fight this war on my own. Wait. If the enemy doesn't kill those guys. I will. I'm not gonna last much longer. Requesting immediate assistance. Over and out. Talking the cork. Those are direct ships destroying that planet. We must help that commando. Are you serious? That's it. I am out of here. Captain Quark is gonna be sorry he messed with me. This is not about Captain Quark anymore. There are innocent lives being lost. Yeah? Well, I'm done with this stupid hero stuff. I got my uh, agenda. Oh, now. yeah, I heroes. Get, I get this the clank like made like well, one you know kind of fuck me. up, but Ratchet just kind of 180s to being a dick Quark. here. You don't know anything about me. I know that you will do the right thing. Well, right now, the thing I want to do is find Quark. How do you start this stupid thing? Have you forgotten? You need a robotic ignition system. I will start the ship if you agree to help that commando. So, blackmail is it? Fine. Just shut up and start the ship. Me, me, me. <laughs> I... Back so soon? Oh, you're talking to me. Yeah. I'm not in the habit of talking to myself, you buffoon. Did you get rid of them? Yes. No. <laughs> well, I, I had this plan, and I thought... You thought? You thought? You I don't think... The I don't care if you permission to think. Idiot. I simply needed you to eliminate those two nuisances before they could cause any real trouble. But I wanted to... Do you still want to be the highly paid spokesman for my planet? 
<laughs> then the next time I yeah. see you to do a job, I want results. Now get out of my sight. You could just, you could literally bend him in half, Cork. You can just like, you could stave, stave his head in. Jack, one punch. bending people in half doesn't pay the bills. By the way, we got a new ship. We stole a quark ship. That's right. Oh, he's just here. Hanging out. Alright, what's up? Pay attention, you deserting maggots! The next time you soldiers try to go AWOL, I'll that, that, myself. I just want to <laughs> Oh! Him. Is this the guy who promotes him? Sarge! Get to the ships out of the sky. This whole planet's gonna be rubble! Meet me at the city entrance! He needs our help. Yeah? Why don't you go help him? Into another trap. Well, go on. Go fight some evil. Why are you a at least dick? I'm not a coward. <sighs> Whatever. As soon as I find Quark, I'm selling you for screw. God damn. You're... <laughs> Ratchet becomes unlikable in this game very quickly. Yeah. Or at least for this level. I remember this level being the, the, the annoying one. He was pissed off because I guess he trusted Quark to... Ball. Devastator! Here we go! Should we get the Mind Glove too? No! We don't need it! The Mind Glove is the Yamcha. We'll never get it. Well... Would that have really helped out with fucking, uh... Probably... Well, maybe the thing walks towards us, well, very slowly, granted. So do these rockets home? I forget. They have minimal homing. Also, they're expensive, so you probably don't want to waste them on those guys. Yeah, what did Replace you... the bomb, I guess. Sure. Oh, it's shit. a fireable bomb. Shit. So, quick select. What are you trying to do? I, I don't know. R1 a few times. And missile. Alright. Uh, where's the. Yeah, this works in the rain. Oh, I'm selling you for scrap. I'm pissed off at... So this is the grind rail part, and the other way is the, the non-grinding route. <laughs> I'm done being a hero! Like... He just suddenly, all of the, all of the teenage angst came flying back to him. He had a bad memory about his childhood. After... I'm the last Lombax! Is that what this is about? No! It doesn't even matter! <laughs> it, it tried so hard, it got so far! Ugh. Oh, I, I, I didn't approach this level, co like, correctly. Here we go. You know what else we have eventually? Slide 3. Yeah, we've never, no, neither of us have played that. Oh, I don't have the manual for Ratchet Clank 1. Can you look it up? Or... I could, I, I just wanted to see if that called him a long Bax. You are my l Ah, oh, shit. Two, three, and... <laughs> Fuck you, Clay! You let us in your time! Wee! Rails! This is fun! Ratchet, are you sure we're not getting distracted? <laughs> Shut up, Clay! Head! Ratchet just, for, for a, a level or two, Ratchet just becomes, like, a middle school bully level of mentality. <laughs> he, he really took, uh... I mean, I guess he really did like Captain Quark. He's really he's just really pissed off at him and wants oh, revenge. Yeah, he's... Uh Halt! Who are you? What are you doing? We are on a mission to save the galaxy. Yeah. Speak for yourself and put your hands down. You look ridiculous. 
Actually, I don't care who you are. I've got to get the heck out of here. I joined the army to get money to go to college. I never knew I'd end up in a war. <laughs> <laughs> what? This That's how they get you. Noble, my Heidi. I just want to get home to my family. Here, I pulled this off a busted robot. Give me some bolts for a bus fare and it's yours. All right, how much bus fare? Two thousand. Yeah, that's oh. bus fare. Bus, quote unquote, bus fare. It's the drugs to make the to make the trip more tolerable, I guess. Thanks a bunch. Good luck saving the galaxy or whatever. Just swims off. Yeah. Greetings, Supreme Executive Chairman Drek. As you can see, we're about to test our newest automated pilot's helmet. This helmet allows pilots to control our latest high-tech pilots using only their thoughts. Please yeah. enjoy the demonstration. And... reverse. Yep! <laughs> we still have a, a few minor adjustments to make. So uh, I think new spaceship wow. we get there or something. Yeah, we get the kinks worked out of that thing. <laughs> I have got to get one of those. If they are working the kinks. for Jim and Greg, they may know where he is. Is that all you can think about? Drek this, Drek that? How do these have people have problems? these random info bots? If you cannot see the importance of this Somehow. situation, you do have problems. Yeah? Well, if you're so smart, how come you're <laughs> <have a smart, laughs> stupid trick? Ah, Poor Plank. It. We both need to get to this planet, and that's all that Is the third matters. game karma for this? <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> you know the part I mean. Oh, yeah, the, 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 the... Oh, you want to be in movies, Ratchet? Well, if you want to be in movies, you, you gotta do what I say. There's a lot more thing. Nothing else here. That was a goal. Yeah. <laughs> this. What do I do? Oh. You need Charlie you need to get up on that roof. I don't need to, but I can. Aha! I'm on the roof! Hey, get down here! Oh, we get two at once for the rocket launcher. Did something just die? Uh, maybe. Okay. I, you know, there's a lot of crossfire. Isn't this an active military, like, operation? Yeah. I imagine things are dying all the time. Oh, man. Speaking of uh, uh, items with the Devastator in them, uh, there, there was a game, uh, Mercenaries 2, uh, World in Flames. Yeah. And, uh, and in, in order to get yourself in with, like, a... A group of, uh, of like, uh, other mercenaries and, like, take subcontracting jobs from them. Uh, you have to, uh, do a thing where you have to pick up, uh, they said, the exact, uh, words they used were, Yeah, some kind of top secret, uh, military equipment, can't say too much. You just go and ask for the Devastator and bring it back here. Yeah. So they go to grab, like, I threw an active Warzo with like uh, with like gorillas and other people just shooting at each other, and then it's him, uh, whoever you choose, just going. I'm here for the Devastator. Oh, <laughs> the Devastator. Yeah, behind the, that fence. You go back there, and it's a moped with like frilly uh, like tassels and stuff. It's pink. Yeah. And he's like, you gotta be kidding me. And you're just driving this thing through a war zone with people shooting at you. And meanwhile, the mercenaries that are like shooting back are like, "Oh, be careful! It might be more bike for you to handle." And he's just like, "It's like working for fucking frat boys. He's unprof." Yeah. <laughs> it's just like sounds more like Dead Rising, to be honest. <laughs> oh man. 
pandemic it was God was a studio God before its time. I would have loved to see them do a third game of that series. The mercenaries. Yeah, they, they, there were two, three characters, but the only one that mattered was the the Swedish dude, because he was uh, he was voiced by uh, I, Peter. I think it was Peter Stromer, the the dude who. Who, like voices every vaguely Russian dude, vaguely uh, European dude in uh, in games. Yeah. He does a really good job playing like a like a dude who's who's like so the the Blackwater equivalent of Kenpachi. Just like open the door, or I'll kill you all. Yeah. I don't trust this water. No, you water are right bad. to not trust this water. Why are... Why was the bridge retracted? Oh, probably war reasons. War reasons. <laughs> I, I... Why did you bomb that village? War reasons. Yeah, that's all you need. The, 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 you sabotaged a nuclear plant to expand radiation across the continent. Why did you do that? Oh, that was a bomb. Take it back. <laughs> oh, how far back? Oh, uh, we're at the beginning All again. Right. All right. What time is it? Uh, 12:45. Okay. We had. You know, I can't believe we're ending this uh, level on like a sour note like this. Yeah, if we can get through this level, it'd be nice. Get through this level so we don't have uh, the the sting of. Uh, I think they make up by the end of this level. I don't think it's drug out too long. It better not be drug out too long. Why would you do a level? Ah, shit! Oh, good, you can grab that. It was this way, right? Yeah, across the bridge. Well, hey, come back here. Careful, that guy killed me. Was that that guy? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't see my ammo in there. Are you, there's some in the sky shooting you? You should go inside. I was trying to. Quite literally, but I got stun locked. You were mashing the attack button. I was, I, he was in front of me. I was trying to... He was an enemy. I had to take him out for war reasons. Any ammo in here? No. I like how it's stable outside the glass container. It just sits there. <laughs> Until you need it. Yes. Because because they're electronic. Why would they not do that outside of the container? Imagine the way they do it. That, that is, It's just easier to ship that way. Yeah. That's why it's like that. Devastator. Tier 1 weapon. Oh, it was a tank. Uh, yeah, yeah. Now what? Oh, where's my cannon? Yeah? Oh, that's rough, buddy. Ah! You hear something? <laughs> you, you hear something? Clank! Clank! I, it's like everybody betray me. I'm fed up with this world. <laughs> you, you, you fool! Do you want it back? Yeah, sure. How's our blaster ammo? Okay, but we're we're slowly filling up by collecting crates. Why'd you? <laughs> That's the smart one. Hit and run. Just wrench him. <laughs> I tried the first time. That's why I switched to the flamethrower. <laughs> Just hit and run all the time. That was 
a mistake. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait. Back to me. Uh, I was trying to get, just get around them without wasting missiles. I mean, they they give it. We found out they give us two devastators at once, though. So it's all right. If it were just one at a time, it, it would be a pain. But uh, I think it's okay to use them because they give you enough. Isn't there a scene where uh, Ratchet at some point just goes like, Come on, Clank, I'm your best friend! It's just like... And uh, that's ironic, considering what, how he how he acts in this section. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna shoot at you. I know. Better retreat. Had to deal with that guy. As a matter of principle. Everything is short ranged in this game. Kinda. Love of Doom. Awesome. All right. Get him! You hear that? You idiots. Oh, I actually the can't hurt the treads. <laughs> Ratchet's got enough strength to tear a tank in half with his bare hands. What are you? Should I be worried about you? Is that a scout? He's bypassed the tank. Now don't do that this thing you did before! I'm gonna throw my wrench this time. Uh, oh, that... Oh, it was, it was even pointless. No, oh, it, it was a gold bowl. I knew I knew it wasn't... This wasn't the intended way. Uh. <laughs> I'm just picturing uh, Ratchet in, like, that one uh, scene in Johnny Mnemonic where, uh, where he's just finally gotten pissed off. And he's like, I've had it with you, I've had it with all of this! I want it! Room service! Yeah. Just screaming in, a, in like a junkyard, but forlornly into the sky, how how he just wants room service and it's just I want my search press at the Imperial Hotel in Tokyo. <laughs> Same guy who does John who is John Wick yeah. did that scene. Did he Keanu was Reeves. Yeah. I feel like it's gonna fill up all of our other ammo before giving us more, uh, Devastator. Yeah. Come out, you fuck! <laughs> you hear something? The sounds are great. <laughs> oh, no! Okay, I'm fine, he missed. Hey, you should get those bolts. I will. They don't disappear. I thought they did. Oh well. Guerrilla warfare! These little bomb fuckers are some of the most annoying enemies. Yeah, despite not appearing very much. Are you done being mad at me, Ratchet? Not yet! One more level! Oh, okay. I'll, I'm gonna remember this. You organics are so hormonal. <laughs> I guess that's why Little White Clank is kind of. Friend, it won't fudge. I've tried everything I know short of nuclear weaponry. Hmm. No, never mind. <laughs> mm -hmm. You tried. See ya. Not so fast, soldier. You're going into that compound even if I have to throw you. Aha! That ventilation shaft leads to the turret platform. Soldier, find a way to use that shaft to infiltrate the compound undetected. <laughs> hmm. You've shown bravery by making it this far, soldier. And for that, I reward you. Have a robot. I accepted this communique that you might find useful. Take it. I'm off to find my battalion. Good luck. Hello once again, fellow blog. I hope this message finds you well. 
As many of you know, our home So he's like the Trump of the blog, right? right? Yeah. Just the we richest dude, our absolute our motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. And, and, and also the more most of the moral, sure. Pollution, leaving much behind. Unfortunately, the nearby planets will supply us with all we need to create our new home, which is nearing completion. Once our scientists locate the ideal orbit, our new world will be perfect. So reserve your space now. Prime locations are filling up fast. Good day. Shit. Now do you understand why we must stop him? He won't rest until he has destroyed every planet in the galaxy. That's yeah. a lot. Well, I got bigger fish to fry. What big fish? In the galaxy. Well, different fish anyway. Look, didn't that commando guy say we could get into that compound? Yes, by using the ventilation shaft. But we will need something special to walk on that. Magnet okay, boots. Going, we'll come back later. You it will need a pair of Gadgetron Magna boots to traverse this ventilation shaft. Unfortunately. So after this, you just kind of stop. You just kind of forget about it. Oh well, we'll come back later, I guess. Oops. So they just kind of stop talk. Like they just stop being a. We don't get a fucking. Oh, I'm sorry. Or anything. What if we? What if we go to another planet and everything's fine, and then we get the boots and we come back here and then they have the their. Uh, then they have their their uh, their their make getting over it. Ratchet, as if we never left. Ra Wait a minute, we were still fighting. Ra Ratchet, why are you so angry at me? I thought we were fine on other planets. I, I don't know. It's this planet. It's this rain. I don't like being wet, Clank. <laughs> this is like, listen, Clank. I'm gonna level with you. It's not that I wanna. It's not that I, I don't wanna be here because I don't think this is important. It's that I really hate being wet. Damn. No effect. What was that? True. The, nothing. Accurately this time. It's just not gonna fucking talk about it. They're just gonna fucking ignore it until they both forget about it. Hope the audience forgets about it. Uh... Oh, that's right, we got two places to go, Bryce. so this is Bryce. for the pilot's Bryce. helmet. And that's for the gravity boots. We're gonna need to hit Bryce. both of them. Yeah. Even, like, at some point. I guess so. it doesn't matter which we which Bryce. we went to first. Yeah, let's just... I remember the orcs on... I think the first time we can only do Clank, and then uh, we go back later with the oxygen mask. I think that's the case. Oh, uh, yeah. I can't... I have to go myself. Because... You can't breathe, you see. Guess. I must go. The planet doesn't need you. <laughs> Alright. Are you over it, finally? I remember this planet having some difficult spots. Next time. Yeah, next time. Make sure. I, th I think it saves automatically every time we go between planets, but just in case... Yeah, I they don't really it. have a fight like this later on in, in like the series. No, they kind of, they get over it. They just kind of bicker. Bryce. Yeah, I mean I'm glad that they don't immediately get along like perfect buddies all the time. But it, it, this particular spot is a little forced. Well, besides, it wasn't like if it was me, right? I would just be all like, "Well, fuck! I can't believe you betrayed us." All right, I, I guess we you're on our shit list now. Guess we're on our own. <laughs> Not like they were struggling without him. It's it's, it's weird that Ratch is just like, oh, fuck the mission. Yeah. I guess he took that really personally. Alright, that's it for today. Yeah, we'll see you guys uh, next time.